the, the bump there. <laughs> I was distracting him from driving. I'm sorry. Can I get you to step out of the vehicle for me, ma'am? Yeah. Police in Utah released video Thursday of an encounter with 22-year-old Florida resident Gabby Petito, now a missing person, and her fiance while they were on a road trip. I been fighting all morning, and, and he wouldn't let me in the car before. And Why I, wouldn't he let you in the car? Because you have OCD? He told me I need to calm down. Body cam footage from August 12th shows Petito tearfully describing a dispute with her fiance, 23-year-old Brian Laundry, who has since been named a person of interest in her disappearance. I was saying, let's just go for a walk, and she was trying to get the keys for me, so I was just going, just wait back up, back up. And Laundry returned home to Northport, Florida on September 1st alone. He was driving Petito's van. Petito's parents reported her missing 10 days later, and Laundry isn't talking. On Thursday, Petito's family appealed through their attorney, Rick Stafford, to Laundry's family, begging them to reveal the last place he saw her. The family is devastated. Every day that this goes on, they get more and more desperate. They, they're, they're at the point that that desperation is turning to anger. They know that the Landrys know where their daughter is, and they will not tell them. That's infuriating. Police said Petito's family last heard from her in late August after she was believed to be in Wyoming. Don't text each other tonight. In the body cam footage, Petito and Laundry described an argument they said became mildly physical to Moab, Utah police who stopped their van after receiving a complaint from a witness about a domestic disturbance. The hour-long roadside encounter did not result in any charges. Petito and Laundry began their cross-country trip in June in her van, posting videos on social media along the way. We just want her home safe with us.